Hey guys, this is a tutorial on this blue makeup. I call Wonder Woman makeup. It's not anything from the Wonder Woman uh, makeup line by MAC at all, but I just accidentally did it one day, so I thought I would share it with you. I already primed my eye with uh, Rubenesque Paint Pot by MAC. I love this. And the new thing I found out that is much easier to do is uh, put a, a creamy highlight um, on because I tend to forget, I don't know why, but I tend to forget to put on my highlight color. But when I put this on, I have my highlight on. And this is the uh, All Over Color Stick by e.l.f. Looks like this. Um, and I think it's called Spotlight. I really love it. So, I prime my eye with that. And you want to take um, um, a soft n nude uh, lavender color or soft uh, pinkish color. I use yogurt uh, by MAC uh, and it has to be a matte color so anything would do but in the lavender pinkish color. So I apply this all over my lid with my Eco Tool fluffy brush. And don't go up too high just right into the crease like that just a tiny bit on the eye yeah and the blue colors I use are from my um, 88 palette. I use this one, this one, and this one. Um, but mostly this one. Uh, dark, crazy, maybe blueish color. I don't know. I'm bad at describing colors. But that is the one you want to use. And I'm going to apply that with my favorite brush right now is from e.l.f. Um, this Shadow C brush, like this. I love it. And just mix these colors together at first. And then you want to kind of draw a line into your crease, like this. If you're not used to do this, just take your time because it takes some practice um, to get this line. And you can open your eye, your eye <laughs> and tilt your head back and then it should be easier for you to do. Kind of like this is just a blue color, but Twiggy actually did this for years, um, just with a a black color. I just applied more of the, the dark blue, and it's, it's metallic, so it's gonna look really, really good. Just like that. I'm not going to blend it or anything because I want the kind of sharp line. And then I'm taking a blue eyeliner. Uh, this is from Gosh. Um, but any kind will do. You can also take any color from the 88 palette that's lighter um, than um, the
the one you used in the crease. And just apply the, the lower lashes. Like that. And take your favorite black eyeliner and put it to the waterline. This is Feline by MAC. I know I'm a MAC freak fan. But this is really, really good. Like that. And then the fun part. Take your favorite uh, gel liner or cream liner. This is a cream liner from Wet n Wild. And <clears throat> I'm using this small pencil. You can use any ankle brush, uh, anything you feel the most comfortable using. And Draw a line. You want this to have a, a small winged out. Like that. Yeah. And finally the mascara. I chose um a really blue one, but I don't know why. This is from Gush. I don't know why, but when it dries, it turns out black. So if any of you knows know where I can find a blue mascara that stays blue, please tell me because I really want a blue mascara and one that stays blue yes this doesn't and just apply you could use just a black mascara if you don't have a blue one but this just makes it more fun Silence. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm concentrating. So. I don't want to put music on my videos because I think I think it's really annoying. So bear with me. I try to make some jokes. Maybe next time. I don't know. On my face, I have Pro Longwear from MAC, uh, my MSF, Natural in Medium, and my blush is um, also uh, by MAC, it's called, called Harmony. I used, used this uh, to contour my face, but I just thought it would give more warmth to my face for this look. Uh, and on my lips, um, you could you you could uh, make a totally wet lip, but maybe more for going out or stuff like that. I have on Love Alert. Um, that's a glass. Looks like this. Really lovely. So I hope you enjoyed, and I make sure to make more videos. I'm. I've been busy like crazy, so hope you enjoy and see you guys soon. Bye.